good with y'all boys, man. Y'all already know 2020 AJ in the building. Heard me? Heard you, boy. Heard. Y'all boys in this thing. Y'all boys winning. Y'all chilling. Y'all boys blessed to see another day. So use that time wisely. You heard me? Heard you. All right, let's get into it. Now, your boy EDP is back, and he probably taking more L's. I heard he's taking a lot of L's right now. So we about to get right into it and see what he talking about. Let's see how many L's he taking. Yeah, we not going to laugh too hard. Stop the cap. We probably gonna laugh. I ain't gonna lie to you. We, we probably gonna laugh. We probably gonna laugh. I ain't even gonna sit here and hold you like that. I'm probably gonna laugh. I'm sorry. I'm not even sorry, bro. Sorry, not sorry. You heard me. Heard you. All right, look at it. However, the craziest update in the EDP 445 tragedy is that only three weeks ago, according to one of his former YouTube buddies by the name of Felipe, the big man himself has actually been put behind bars. This is the um, Henderson, Nevada Detention Center. They don't call him in 4K for real? That's tough. 18th of no April comment. 2021, no things were actually going reasonably well for EDP 445. If you look at his social blade graph, you'll see that he gained <clears> 520,000 <throat> subscribers over the course of two months in April and May of 2020. You know why he gained that many? Because that's when they put him on blast, okay? They put him on blast at that same time. And then after that, he went, bloop, just simply because nobody wants to follow a pedo, man. I'm just saying. People loved him because he was one of the last few YouTubers who had absolutely no filter. He was unconcerned about ad revenue and therefore swore like a trooper while tackling some of the most crass yet hilarious topics. EDP 445's unconventional mind was always spoken honestly, so he stood out as unique. It's not surprising either. In a world where everyone else online is always walking on Hey yo! Hey, hey bro! Hey, you look like a weirdo on this one. I ain't gonna cap to you. Look what you look like, bro. I ain't look. Else, trying not to offend anyone, oh, EDP 445's brash out. attitude and make unapologetic sure approach to life was somewhat refreshing for those who saw the world in a similar way. However, of course, such an approach wasn't without controversy. In 2017, as a result of his unconventional content, he'd be banned from YouTube for a period of two weeks, while Twitter was a little harsher, placing a ban on his main EDP 445 account permanently. That's Additionally, tough. after hitting 1 million subscribers in early 2020, you Okay, I've got, I got a question. How do you get banned on Twitter? Because I see a lot of people get banned on Twitter. Belle Dauphine got banned. I think Celestia Vega got banned. Freaking Zoe Berger, I think, also got banned at one point. How do you get banned on Twitter? Literally, people on Twitter have no filter at all. The people on Twitter, I could you not. Those people are the most out-of-pocket people on the planet. Like, you on Twitter, you got to be out-of-pocket. And if you think anything funny, you're out-of-pocket yourself. I'm just saying. Yeah. Would be having some cursed stuff on there sometimes. YouTube refused to send EDP a gold play button, stating that the channel didn't match their eligibility criteria. Because according to them, my channel doesn't match the criteria. Well, I know you ain't crying. Criteria, <laughs> and I'm like, my channel has zero community guideline strikes. It has zero copyright strikes. 445 was caught in 4K on his way to <laughs> a cupcake. The topic was covered by almost everyone in the commentary hey, community. No I'm sure by now many of you have at least heard of the EDP. Wait, 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 what? I just thought of some cursed. The cupcake, think about it. Hey yo! Four five hey, situation yo. creators who supported him in the past, such as some ordinary gamers, would upload a video titled "EDP four four five needs to be arrested." Another method that EDP had for earning an online income was Cameo. You could order a personalized video and. Fucking way, boy. Boy ain't no way, boy. Boy ain't no way, boy. Y'all was buying Cameo from EDP four four five? Hey yo, bro. Y'all y'all need some help, G. I promise you, y'all need some help. No, ain't no way. Get EDP to ain't say no way. I'm him doing to that. For the low no. price of $44. However, following the infamous cupcake event, Cameo would be contacted by numerous individuals who would receive responses along the lines of, hey there, thank you for reaching out. Our team is aware of the allegations and are actively investigating this. Thank you for bringing it to our attention. What, Kindly what believe it. Less than a week later, EDP 445's Cameo account was deleted. Another income say? stream had gone up in smoke. EDP 445 then attempted to switch to Facebook. However, after 
after gaining 6,000 followers, too. he'd be banned from the I know y'all remember that because y'all watched that video. On Facts. Instagram. His main account was terminated, at which point EDP was likely coming to terms with the that. harsh reality of his cancellation. I was deleted. I don't have a clue what's going on. I didn't violate any guideline. Can you please tell me what's going on? EDP. After this ban, it seemed <laughs> as though EDP 445 was slowly getting the message from each and every website. His career on the internet was finished. However, the internet wasn't finished with ending his career. Rich from Review Tech USA would state that he might be able to get a job working somewhere like Starbucks. However, it was only going to be so long before the trolls would come and inform them of his past. But I don't even know if you could get a damn job at Starbucks and keep it because you know the trolls are going to come after you and say, oh yeah, that guy you just hired, I wouldn't keep him employed probably lose a job at right, coffee bro, my shop phone too, is real going quick. Ballistic. Rich would be correct in this statement. EDP 445 moved from Bakersfield, California to Henderson, Nevada following the expose, where it seemed as though he managed to land a job as a Lyft driver in October 2021. However, this job would be fairly short-lived, as a video posted to TikTok by a user called Lennon Jimenez so would expose EDP 445's Lyft profile. Bro went from wanting cupcakes to driving for Lyft. And his position as a driver I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> subsequently Woo! removed by the company. That's funny. The situation would promote Reddit discussion with one post stating EDP as a Lyft driver, how the mighty have fallen, which received comments such as, can you take me to the grocery store? I'm gonna go buy some cupcakes. <laughs> And I hope he doesn't get on any food delivery apps. Oh. MF would eat my fries and I'd have missing slices of pizza. <laughs> I, hope he doesn't get on any food delivery apps. Dude would eat my fries and I'd have missing slices of pizza. Obviously, oh, it was revealed today thereafter that EDP had in fact been driving no, by Uber bro. Eats and Grubhub, which would also no. fire him after finding out about the drama. EDP has been attempting to change his name legally. The application shown on screen states that Bryant Morland applied for a name change with the Nevada. Nevada County Court on the 21st yes, of October 2021. The strange part about this is that when you try and search the court register from the Reddit post by typing in his name, Bryant Morland, it now states that there are no results found, possibly indicating that EDP 445's name change has been successful and he's no longer known as Bryant Morland. As you can see, I did type in his name, Morland Bryant, submit. That's no tough. results found. However, the problem with this, as outlined by the ADP 445 subreddit, is that he's not exactly hard to spot. This idiot thinks this will fix anything, Lameo. He'll be spotted. Like, literally, your face was put on the internet. So, no matter changing the name or nothing, like, it's inevitable at this point. Nobody's not going to accept you. Even if you change your name, that stuff's still in your records. Change your name. All people got to do is look you up online. Legit. I'm just saying. Everywhere, no matter his name. He should flee to Cuba or something like this. Changing his name isn't a good idea since it's going to get leaked anyways. What good does changing a name do when you're as easily recognizable as him, LOL? He needs to lose hundreds Facts. of pounds and get a hair transplant. Perhaps the goal is to have- Okay, yeah, I can understand that completely. Okay, say he went and got a surgery, did, and he looked completely different. That will be understandable. But he looks the exact same, same build, same, wears the same clothes. So- they go spot him out easily. They be like, oh, that's EDP right there, bro. You know? Everybody know you is EDP. So it's like, even if they don't know you're real, even if they don't know when you change your name, it's going to get exposed because you were still at the top of the, you were at the top of the food chain at one point. Yeah, think about that. But he obviously didn't. That man's stupid. I'm sorry, bro. Have his name hidden for long enough in order to get a job, as other sources state that he's been unsurprisingly struggling with money. He's broke. Like, YouTube made him money, but after having that, he got it broke real quick. A user by the name of Master at Work, who was one of the people trying to expose EDP all the way back in 2020, stated in October that EDP had less than $3,300 cash left in his account, plus two cars and a couple of other things that he might be able to sell. The only income that he has, other than the 3,300 that he has left in his bank account, is maybe the 40 grand in weapons and the two cars that he owns. 40 grand in weapons? That's probably why he broke right there. Spending unnecessary money on weapons is not that serious, bro. Just get one little pistol and just be done with that. Like, what do you need 40 grand in weapons for? That's pro that's why people go broke. They spend money on unnecessary stuff like that. Like, okay, getting a car? Okay, you got a dream car. Cool. You go buy that you go buy that dream car. Leave it alone after that. If you're not making money consistently, leave it alone. 
EDP set him on stuff. He set his own stuff up for failure. That's all I'm gonna say. However, in the two months since October, users on Reddit used his car's license plate to confirm that EDP 445 has sold one of his cars, possibly indicating that his cash stack has dwindled even further. In the same live stream during which Master at Work would discuss EDP's financial situation, it also mentioned that EDP had been evicted from his apartment complex as the property owner received numerous complaints about having him as a tenant. Call up Spur Apartments and verify it for yourself. Um, EDP will no longer be living at Spur Apartments. The reason why he got evicted is because of a constant constant harassment the property owner has been getting. Since then, EDP has been living out of a suitcase at various hotels. However, even then, his detractors have been going around trying to get him kicked out of wherever he happens to be staying. If you can't this point of the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. Don't forget to join the Noti gang. Go ahead and turn on your notifications. It's Georgia made AJ and it's 22, baby. It's 2022. We trying to, we're on the road to 500 here, man. Road to 500. And don't forget, I done made some merch, man. I done made merch with Teespring. They not sponsored me or whatever, but I'm just trying it out for now. So if y'all want to go down below and buy some, go down below in the description right now. It's there. So if y'all want that, just let me, don't let me know. Just go ahead and buy it, you know. I got hoodies. It's just a simple one-man army logo, and then it's like my YouTube logo on the back, and it says, bless for another day. Use it wisely. So, you, yeah. So... If y'all want to go check that out, go ahead and check it out. It's down below in the, in the description. Other than that, if you made it to this point of the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. Go, leave a comment, please. Leave a comment and let me know. Just say something like, I'm here, or 2022, let's get it, or something. Something. Just leave a comment. Let me know if you made it to this far in the video. And, yeah, I'll see y'all boys in the next one. Peace.